Hi friends! Today is going to be my TBR for the month of May. <laughs> First, I do want to say that for my TBR this month, there will be a readathon. Uh, Kate Cav and I are hosting called the 24 Hour Rereadathon. I will link that in the description box down below, the announcement for that. And my TBR for that will be up on Wednesday. There will be six books there that we're not going to talk about today. Today, we're just going to talk about all the other books I'm going to try to read in May. I'm going to need all the help I can get as per usual. The Avengers Initiative Reading Challenge book this month is Rise of the Red Hand and I don't remember the name of the author but it's here. You can see it. Don't know what it's about either. So, so far, so good. Also in the vein of readathons and reading challenges and reading groups, uh, J.D. Ray Reads is hosting the Wishland series and this month we are up to Sight Witch. So I will be reading Sight Witch this month. It's a short baby, so that's good. And for the AuthorTube Chat Book Club, which I host with Kate Cavanaugh as well, our group book for May and June is I Believe in a Thing Called Love by Maureen Goo. So I'll be reading that this month as well. And then I just have an entire slew of arcs. I'm behind on arcs. So basically what we're going to learn is that at some point this month I'm going to run out of audiobooks and I'm going to be like what am I going to read? Because almost everything I plan to read this month is a physical book. Well a digital copy of a book. We know that I do the majority of my reading via audio so what am I going to read via audio? I don't know. Uh, but uh, the list of arcs I currently have and need to read are Kisses and Croissants don't remember who that one's by. That one came out in April. Also came out in April was Slingshot. Also don't remember who that one's by. Those are both Wednesday book titles that I agreed to a while ago and then kind of forgot about but also had them in my TBR for like February and then forgot. So I'm doing great so far. Um, also arc books. Uh, Sloppy First by Megan McCafferty, which is actually a republishing of a series that she published I think in the 90s. So I'm super excited to read those. I'm sure that it's like updated for modern day. I mean, maybe. I don't know. It would make sense. But it's just like, it's a YA rom-com. So here for that. People We Meet on Vacation by Emily Henry. Really enjoyed Beach Read. So all over People We Meet on Vacation. Want to read that. Ten Truths and a Dare by Ashley Elston. That is the sequel to Ten Blind Dates. That was my favorite book of 2019 that I reread a couple of months ago. I'm super excited for that. Spells Trouble by PC and Kristen Cass. It is, um, I believe it's Twin Witches. I think it's a Twin Witches story, if I remember correctly. Super excited for that excited for everything. Oh and the other one is Blood Like Magic by Lizelle Sanbury. I did get an arc for that um, and I do plan, I'm going to attempt to vlog my reading of Blood Like Magic um, to post a couple of weeks before the book comes out in June um, because Lizelle is a fellow author tuber and a friend of mine and I will link her channel in the description box down below. Blood Like Magic is coming out in June. It's her debut. I'm super excited for it. Um, of all of the arcs that I'm reading this month, probably most excited for that one and also Ten Truths and a Dare because favorite book of 2019. Like I'm really excited for the follow-up. I've got a bunch of arcs to read. I've got a couple of book club books to read. What am I going to be listening to? So that's my very short TBR update for May. No clue what's going on audiobook wise but definitely have a lot of arcs that I want to get to. That is all I have for today. I post reading, writing, book, and planner related videos a couple of times a week. If you don't want to miss anything I have going on in the future make sure you subscribe and until then I will see you guys next time. Bye! <laughs>